What does it feel like when you meditate? There are times when you have more thoughts, and that could be a sign of stress being released. And there are times that you go to a very blissful place that feels as if it's in another world, and you feel very connected somehow to the universe. And it's such a, a pleasurable feeling, but yet very meaningful. It's a f wonderful way of accessing inner creativity. And I, I really don't think I would be half the musician I am or have half the career I've had if I had not meditated for all these years. The science of creativity and meditation, what does that mean? Creativity is the pulling together of disparate ideas, things that are obviously being generated in different parts of the mind, when they look at the wavelengths in different parts of the brain, they find that there's a correspondence that they call coherence that increases when you meditate. What does meditation, doesn't make everybody a great concert guitarist, doesn't make everybody a, a brilliant psychiatrist. Wow. What, what role does meditation have in that skill set? Well, I think it takes the things that we basically are good at and it brings out the best in us. What are the other elements that a person could do to foster or facilitate the creative process? Creativity, it just doesn't just happen. It has to be cultivated. And that's, um, you, you know, can be quite an arduous process. Back when I was in college, the, the woman upstairs uh, came knocking at my door and said, why are you playing the same thing over and <laughs> over and over and over again? <laughs> Can you teach creativity? Everybody can become better than what they are. You can teach people to remove obstacles to their creativity. They may be very, very creative, but they may be putting up unnecessary barriers. The best developments in creativity occur when you are willing to consider the unimaginable. Right. And that's when you really break through. And things that seemed ridiculous later look obvious. Today's life is surrounded with technology and constant communication. How does that impact creativity and our regular functioning on the brain? I think it impacts it very badly, actually. What we're talking about with creativity is allowing some silence to come into the psyche so that the good stuff can come bubbling up. Mm -hmm.